Hi, this is Dr. Ben Ben. I'm a board certified dermatologist. Today, we are going to be doing another stem cell therapy for hair loss on the scalp. And we are joined by one of our lovely patients today who came down to see us today. Um, may I actually show you sure. as possible? So this is the area where we're going to be focusing on basically right here. It's just thinning out in this area. I've already drawn a line. What we're going to be doing right now, we're actually going to numb it in a circular fashion. And when we numb it, he's not going to feel any of the picks and any of the pokes basically that we're going to do while we're doing the stem cell therapy. So we're injecting lidocaine and what we do, we do in a circular fashion and by doing this in a circular fashion it numbs everything within the circle. So what then when I do the stem cells you're really not going to feel it. Okay, we're just going to clean you up and we're going to go to the other room. Okay. So this is going to be the third span that we're going to do for the PRP. Uh, and after this, basically, we're going to mix it with the stem cells and we're going to go from there. Okay, PRP with stem cell. This is the gold right here, guys. Now we're going to inject it. Okay, bring your head. So the area we're going to focus basically is right here. So, how does it feel? I can hardly feel it. You can hardly feel it. Here we go. Guys, this is the whole point of doing the numbing initially in a circle fashion. Now, if you see, I'm injecting this in a very controlled fashion is a very systematic way of injecting okay now we're going to do a little bit in this frontal part here so just go in there and inject it So we're going to wait about three to four months to see the final optimal results. Uh, and basically, we're going to go from there. Well, welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Nice to see you. So what That's do you think good. about your hair? I, I like it a lot. I, I couldn't believe how much improvement I've had. Okay. So tell me. So first of all, did you... Uh, first of all, are you happy with the results? Yes. Okay. Happy. And do you see visible hair growth on your scalp? Yes. Okay, now how did you see that growth? Did it happen gradual over time or did you wake up one morning and there was like, like a lot of hair? Uh, it was kind of gradual but it seemed like sometimes there were spurts yes. and I was like, where did like this, like all this clump of hair, like, like I don't know, from? like try to comb it this way or that way. Okay. So, but actually that's a good, that's a good thing. Let's take a look at the hair. Let's see. Bring the hair all the way down. So this is his actual hair. We mainly focus in the crown area and I'm going to use a comb literally just to move around. Look, it is... It's his natural hair. There's no hair transplants and there's no hair grafts. What it did, what the stem cell did, basically, it caused his natural hair basically to grow out. I mean, this is really phenomenal. Like this was an area till till a few months ago. I mean, there was hair, but really not that much. You were able to see a large area of it basically being thinned out. And look at it; it's pretty much all covered and uh, uh, pretty much covered with his own natural hair. This Any other advice you have for other patients out there that are considering that are not hair transplant candidates, but are considering considering to do like the stem cell? Um, I highly recommend the stem cells. Uh, I just, I've had friends and uh, I know people that try things that have you know not been the best results for the cost and uh, I guess the expectations. Right. So this, I think your techniques are, you know, I'm lucky. I think we're lucky we found each other. Well, look, look, I'm very happy. I'm really excited. I think it looks fantastic. Thank so you. congratulations. Thank you. And thank you so much. Thank you.